this is the right opportunity to pull up your socks get straight to the market take the strategy i'm going to give away right now and use it through your account and grow your account after you've just grown your account i'll be very glad if you come back and leave a feedback for the strategy so many people can see how legit the strategy is without further ado guys let's go straight to crash 500 and see if this the strategy is corresponding to the market let's go ahead to crash 500 index as you can see guys yes sir the strategy so here guys this is how crash 500 looks like and this is how our indicators which are our strategy looks like so here guys uh the strategy easily so show you where to enter and where to exit that's my favorite part there many people didn't realize this but i did realize that it shows you where to enter as well as where you can exit guys let me explain the strategy without further ado first of all let me just show you the indicators we are, we are going to use the awesome oscillator as well as the our relative strength index make sure you subscribe make sure you leave a thumb guys so i'll be encouraged to create more content so guys let's first of all let's just go ahead and check for the relative strength index settings first here we are we apply our period at 10 we apply we apply to close then our levels guys a big note here our levels are the most important key for the strategy here we are guys here are the levels we have we have level 10 we have level 20 level 50 level 80 as well as level 90 and press done you are done with your levels now the only thing i have to do is to give you the settings for awesome oscillator but first i just decided to explain the strategy and then i will give the settings after i have explained the strategy here guys let me explain how you can be able to catch your spikes using a simple strategy guys this is the simplest strategy you will find on youtube on how you can be able to catch spikes as well as the strategy shows you your entries and your exit let's check how you can be able to enter the trade so here guys let's say you see are uh, the strokes of the awesome oscillator showing you that it's a downtrend you just relax and be patient and wait for the awesome oscillator to show you that this is the right opportunity for you to enter the market as well as is an uptrend as well you can see here the strokes are coming to the upside as you can see here around this area here before it can change the market movement and show you that it's an uptrend again you just have to wait for the last stroke here that it that it can be able to show you so now let me explain it to you the entry point here we go this is this was your entry point the tiniest stroke that occurred the tiniest stroke you can see the tiniest stroke here it's your entry point whereby the market is changing to an uptrend that is going to change sooner enough to be a downtrend so here this was your entry point here you can see the tiniest stroke was your entry point so how can you be able to catch the spike so first of all you have to count the strokes five times so let's count it let's count the strokes together let me zoom in let's count the strokes together this was your entry point here and above your entry point above your entry point that's where you start to count so this was my entry point so above the entry point we start to count entry point above the entry point let's count let's start right now one stroke occurred two three here four and the fifth the fifth stroke that's where the spike seems like it just occurred you can see it was a spike it just spiked in let me show you another example of an entry point let me show you an, another example of an entry point this was your entry point here this was your entry point you can see let's just count together this was your entry point here so and above your entry point that's where you start to count so this was your first your first stroke above the entry point one two three four five and six and this time the spike just occurred on the sixth stroke so guys actually the sixth stroke that's where is your exit point you see between your fifth between your sixth and your seventh stroke that's where is your entry point your exit point i mean so let me show you the the let me show you your exit point 
So the exit point is whereby you found yourself counting the strokes until you reach the seventh and the eighth strokes. So if you're counting your strokes and you found yourself counting the seventh and the fifth, the, I meant the, the sixth and the eighth strokes, that's where you exit your positions. There will be no spikes occurring from that point. The spikes only occurred in on the sixth and the fifth strokes. Now oh guys, what is left for me is to save my promises from you because I just said I'm going to show you this, the, the settings for Awesome Oscillator. Let me show you the settings from Awesome Oscillator. Thank you if you just watch this video till the end. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you leave a thumb so others can reach the video and get the help they need. Let me show you the settings from Awesome Oscillator. So here we have the Awesome Oscillator. You have your line width at 1 pixel and your value up must be green, your value down must be red and press your down. Thank you for watching your boy Forex Hundreds.